Google Lock, also known as FRP, is an important security measure on Samsung, Android-powered phones that prevents unauthorized users from accessing your device after restoring factory settings. This feature is automatically activated if you have a Google account associated with your Samsung device. If you have forgotten your Google account password or are experiencing issues with your Samsung phone being locked after restoring factory settings, you can use the following three methods to bypass Google Lock on all Android versions of Samsung phones. How to bypass Google Lock on Samsung Free? Then, Samsung FRP SIM PIN method is for you. Using this Samsung FRP bypass code is by far one of the easiest ways to bypass FRP Samsung. This method uses your SIM to receive a link or code from Google to reset the password. Therefore, you'll have to put your SIM into another device to receive the text from Google. Here's what to do to complete FRP bypass Samsung in this way. 1. Once you reset your Samsung phone, it will ask you to enter your Google credentials. Tap on Forgot Password at this point. 2. Take out your SIM from a locked Samsung phone and put it in any other device. Select the option to reset the password using your phone number. You will receive the link to reset your password via text. 3. Once you set up a new password, you can use it to access your locked Samsung phone. You don't need a PC for this method. First open your device settings. Here you will find an option called Accounts. Click on that option and select the Google Account option here. You will find the Google Account app on that account. After that you will find an option to delete the account from the device. Just click on that option. This option requires you to enter your device password. If you have forgotten it, we recommend you to try the last method. Now everything is ready. You can reset your device. The most convenient and safe way to bypass Google Lock on Samsung is to use a professional Android unlocking tool, such as DroidKit. It is a complete Android device toolkit that helps to bypass FRP lock on Samsung safely and securely. In addition, it can also be used to unlock Android lock screen, upgrade system, recover lost data, fix underlying system errors, etc. Here are some of the main features of DroidKit and Samsung FRP Bypass. And DroidKit supports all Samsung devices with Android 6-13, like Samsung S24, S23, A51, etc. Just free download DroidKit and here are the steps to use it to FRP Bypass Samsung. Firstly open DroidKit on your PC or Mac and click the FRP Bypass option from the interface. Then connect your Samsung device to your PC using a USB cable and click Start. Then you need to choose the device brand. Then DroidKit will prepare a configuration file for your device. Therefore, don't unplug your phone during the process. After that, click on Start to Bypass. Then select your Android system version from the given options and then click Next. Now continue following the on-screen instructions on the DroidKit interface to complete some settings on your device. Once you complete the steps on the screen, it will bypass the FRP lock on your device, and then you can access your phone easily. In addition, DroidKit has the following advantages. Bypass Samsung FRP instantly. In just a few minutes, you can successfully bypass the FRP lock slash Google account on your Samsung device and access your device. Easy to operate, no need for technicians. You can easily use DroidKit to bypass FRP right at home. Highest compatibility and success rate. It supports Android 6 and above versions and provides corresponding solutions for different systems to ensure that everyone can successfully bypass Google accounts. Not only Samsung, it can also help you bypass FRP on Xiaomi, Redmi, Poco, and Oppo devices. 100% safe and clean, it has advanced encryption technology and doesn't contain any malware. Guarantee the security of your privacy and device. Just download a DroidKit software, and you can easily solve all your Samsung problems. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. See you next time.